Hey guys, happy Tuesday. So on Tuesdays, day two, week two of our open prep cycle, Tuesdays we typically squat now. So the last several cycles, we always introduce squats on a Monday and a Friday. Today we just have Tuesdays. We never wanna not squat during um, these things. And so we wanna go through our back squat and our front squat. All the things remain the same. Back squat, um, create the shelf between your shoulder blades, below your neck. And then we wanna keep both feet on the ground, knees out, chest tall, right? And we just wanna make sure that we're recruiting the back part of our legs and not necessarily the front part of our legs. And so the back squat will look like this. and we'll walk that in. So our front squats, everything stays the same body-wise, except the barbell is in front of the neck on top of the shoulders, right next to it, comfortably uncomfortable, right? So if we can keep our whole hand underneath the bar, that's great. If we have to like roll and have our hands open to get the elbows um, pointed forward, that's completely great, all right? So we want our elbows always to be pointed away from the ground. So as we come here, Elbows up, and then the body stays the same. And walk that in. And so that'll be your back squat and your front squat. So that's what we'll do for our strength or skill component. And for our workout today, guys, pretty simple. Simple doesn't necessarily mean easy, it just means simple. We got wall balls and we got burpees, right? It's a lot of wall balls and it's a lot of burpees. And the burpees are to a target. So typically, um, whenever we do burpees, we just kind of just let you guys go. Um, we want to introduce a target to create a standard. Um, it's very important to create a standard around the competition or judging components. So that's typically the reason why. You're not going to get you're not gonna get like categorically fitter from a target, but like it's just gonna create the standard where everybody is kind of doing the same thing. So um, we'll come back here to this wall ball. And ideally we wanna kind of pick a target that's you know slightly where we can have to jump to it. Um, so that's kind of how you wanna get that set up. And so your wall balls, you guys have passed to a squat. Toss to the target. And it's really important that the wall balls you guys create um, a sequence where you guys can just like continuously move. It's almost like a, you know, a feedback loop, right? A positive feedback loop with wall balls. Positivity and wall balls. Couldn't connect those, right? So we do our burpee, chest hits the ground, hit the target, chest hits the ground, hits the target. And so again, those two moves, very, very simple. Not easy whatsoever. You guys are have fun. You guys are work hard. Happy Tuesday.